welcome back to my channel. My name is Cassie if you guys are new here. So I just pulled up to my spin class. I'm taking a 7 a.m. power ride spin class at Rebel. I made myself a little Nespresso at home with almond milk. So I'm drinking this now. And today I'm going to do a little morning in my life. Show you guys what I do in the morning before I start my 9 to 5. I thought this would be kind of interesting to watch because I always like to see what people do before they start work and how they can be like productive before starting work. I usually start work around 8.30 today I have a few meetings so I woke up pretty early I'm gonna get my workout in I'm kind of doing like my morning routine before I actually have to start work and this is something I love doing because it just gives me a little bit of me time in the morning so I hope you guys enjoyed this little video subscribe if you are not already but let's get started on my morning routine right now it's Tuesday 6 53 I woke up at 6 15 I made my lemon water did a little bit of stretching made my coffee and now we're gonna get a good workout in good workout my hair is so disgustingly sweaty I need to go home and shower I love getting my workout done in the morning before I start work it's like the best I I'm such a morning person I always say like I peak in the morning in the afternoon and come like four o'clock and downhill so I love getting my workout done in the morning I just feel like I'm such a different person and my endorphins are high so if you guys feel like working out in the morning makes you have more of a productive day and you just feel happier throughout the day, highly recommend to wake up maybe an hour earlier, get your workout in. It doesn't have to be out. It could be home. That's what I did for like five, six months and I still do that. Um, but it felt really good to just be out at a studio. We were only in the parking lot. I showed a little bit in the vlog of like what we were doing. But it was an hour power ride with Lori. She's one of my favorites and it was so good. It's really warm out today too it's a little bit sticky but the breeze was nice so i'm gonna go home shower make some breakfast and i'll show you guys what i end up making just got out of the shower there's nothing better than taking a nice long shower after you work out and are sweaty then I'm just going to do my skincare routine. So I'm wearing makeup today and a lot of times I like to do my skincare routine and then give it a little bit before I put my makeup on. So I still have an hour before my meeting. So I'm going to do my skincare and then do my makeup. Um, sometimes I've only been doing my makeup like with my eyes because when I wear a mask, nobody can see it from here down. So it's like, why wear the foundation? But I don't know, maybe today, well, it's been so humid in Buffalo lately. I love the warm weather, but the humidity has been like on another level lately and I can't handle it. Also, my last vlog, I was talking to you guys about how I have a little breakout here. It's starting to go away. I think I've dried it out. I use this Mario Badescu drying lotion. You guys have probably seen this so many people use it. If this will ever focus. This is the drying lotion. It does wonders if you have like a pimple or any sort of blemish on your face. It just dries it out the next day. I feel like it's gone. So I love using that. And then also, so when people ask me what I do for tanning, and I use this. So it's the Lux Unfiltered Sivan Ayla made it. She's a blogger. And basically, it's a natural, non toxic, vegan, hydrating, self tanning lotion. I really like it because it doesn't make you blotchy at all. It doesn't make you streaky. It just gives you a really nice, hydrated glow. Sometimes when I get out of the shower, my legs are like really scaly and, is that the word, scaly? I think so. And this really helps just keep my tan. I've been trying to be better about the sun lately, just keeping my SPF on. And I love this. I bought this, I think four or five months ago, and I still have a good amount left. So this is what I use for my self tanning. And then for my face, I use the Isles of Paradise self tanning drops. You guys have probably seen these all over. I use the medium. I'm not going to put them on today because I put them on yesterday, so I feel like my face is good. And then, last but not least, going to go in with my face SPF. So I've been using this brand, Super Goop. It's the Unseen Sunscreen SPF 40. I love it because you can't even tell that it's on your face. It literally is unseen for a reason. That's what it's called. And you just put a little bit on your face and rub it in. It just glides on really nice. Love. 
super goop. Check it out. my little post-workout breakfast bunch of water then I've got two eggs with some egg whites a sprout of Great Ezekiel toast I always show you guys this bread I have it like every day and then some fresh fruit so some good protein last vlog I talked about how I wasn't in the mood for eggs but they've been growing on me back again so this is my little breakfast I'm gonna start work now I have my meeting soon but just wanted to update you guys Here is my work outfit for today. So I just have this little white blouse on. I think I got it from H&M. I have these navy pants on, also from H&M. And then I have these little flats on. I think I got it from Nordstrom Rack. So this is my little work outfit for the day. It's pretty hot out today, so I hope I'm not too warm. I still have to like fix my hair because it's drying right now. But I want to show you guys basically what I wear when I have to go out to work meetings. Just this cute little outfit. A lot of my work clothes, by the way, I do get from H&M or Zara because I feel like they're really good quality and they're pretty affordable too. So if you guys are working nine to five as well and you need some like work clothes, definitely check out those places because they're cute, they're high quality, and they're not too expensive. So I just did my makeup, I got ready for the day, I'm drinking another coffee. So that is basically everything that I do before I start my nine to five. The mornings are like my me time. I love to get up at least three hours earlier than I actually have to start work because I love to get my workout in. I like to have my morning routine. I don't like to be rushed and I just feel like I'm more productive throughout the day. I feel like I'm more grounded. So that is something I highly encourage you guys to do too. If you feel like you wake up and you're rushing to work or you're rushing to start your day, um, go to bed a little bit earlier, wake up a little bit earlier and you will have a little bit more time for yourself to be grounded, to feel better. And I think your day will be more productive because I feel that way too. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a like, give it a thumbs up, it really supports my channel. Don't forget to subscribe because I upload every single Tuesday and Friday. And don't forget to check the notification bell so you guys get notified every single time I upload. If you have video recommendations, let me know. Also, also, I am having an apartment tour coming soon. I've just been saying this and since I moved in, you know when you just feel like your apartment or your house is never actually finished? That's what I've been saying, but I'm just making excuses and I really wanna film one. So pretty soon that will be coming on my channel. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you like seeing my morning before I start my corporate job and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.